it's Regina and Sabrina. And we're going to be checking out, hopefully, Pol we say her name right Polina Gagarina. Gagarina. We apologize. Sure. <laughs> we sincerely apologize if we mess up her name. We got requests for her. She was on Singer 2019. So we're going to be checking out her performance of Cuckoo. I think that was the name of the song. And um, we're really excited about this. We're really excited. I saw this request uh, she's, in the comments. She's, yeah. she's new to us. She we, we, we are not familiar with her. So we did our research. We looked her up. She is... Um, a Russian singer, the first was to born March 27, 1987. Oh, she's, an actress, she's a Russian singer, songwriter, actress, and model. Uh, she's not verified in. Okay, that must mean somebody is not verified. This is Wikipedia. So, she represented Russian, Russia in the Eurovision Song Contest 2015 with a million voices, where she finished second. She also participated in the Chinese reality competition, Singer, which is where we're going to watch her at, where she was one of the finalists. Wow. So we're going to be checking this out. There are no English lyrics on this. Um, I'm not 100% sure of the song. It's, it's, I'm pretty sure this is Cuckoo. Um, I found a song online with that title that I think was that she sang. Um, and what I'm going to do is we have already read the lyrics because I'm, I'm worried that this might be the wrong lyrics. <laughs> so we have read the lyrics um, and just wow. I'm not gonna read them out loud in case I'm wrong. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna link the lyrics in the description. So in the description, if you'd like to see where we found the translation of the lyrics, you can click on the, on the um, link that I have next to lyrics and see what we read. And you can let us know if those were the wrong lyrics, um, but just in case this is not the right ones, because it was the only ones I found online, um, we'll just we'll just link them in the description. But it looks like it's it's very, very powerful. The one that we has talked about, palm turning into fist, gunpowder, gun give me fire, mm -hmm. that kind of thing. Yeah. So we are really excited, especially after reading those lyrics, if they are accurate, to see her performance. Thank you for the request, by the way. We're excited because, okay, this singing competition, the singer singing competition has, has given us like the most amazing artists. Like we have fallen in love with all the, the singers that we've seen on it so far. So. I like that opening on the piano. It is real pretty. Ooh, I like this outfit with the... Oh, she's beautiful. Oh, she's getting ready for something. Wow. 
love it when she love whispers. Her. It has such a fierceness to it. Like, does that make sense? Oh, and she bowed out there at the end. Wow. Y'all, that had such a fear. It's not like shows like such. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Download. You can download an app for full episodes and more. Y'all, you can download an app for the full episodes and more. You know what? Um, wow. She has a. What I call. I'm not musically inclined on what like a husky soprano yeah that is very similar to like a dale type of husky it's very beautiful it's like a very husky type but i don't know how to you when know, she whispers yeah because no, i'm not, talking about even when her her, her high range, range. So it's, it's kind of like you know like um None of us are vocally trained, by the way. Neither one of us are vocally no, trained. No, I'm just telling but, you my personal opinion. Yeah. Like my personal opinion on it is what Pretty makes sure her, her voice so beautiful is that she has like that, that what I call, what I think in my head when I think of it is what I call a husky soprano. It's like a low voice, but it registers so high. You know what I'm saying? Right, yeah. So I call it like a husky soprano type voice, but it, it whew, it's the kind of voice that just, you know. It gives you shivers. Yeah, that gives okay, you shivers. Well, Okay. The only way I know to describe it was it was very fierce. It was very fierce. It was very fierce. It was a very fierce performance. And it was, I love that it was fierce and she didn't hold back. Like, even when she was whispering, it felt fierce. Like, it was like this whole Her whispering was whisper. everything. It was like, so it was beautiful. So pretty. Like, it opened like, with I that. I cannot sound that pretty whispering. Well, what was impressive <laughs> is she went from whisper to wide, like, right afterwards. And so, like, it was like this whole whisper and then wide. And it was very fierce. And it was beautiful. And the way she, you could tell that she was really into it because the way she lifted her arms in those moments. And I kept doing this because she was doing that. She had her, her fists like clenched. And that's what I'm talking about. It just felt like an entirely fierce performance. And if the lyrics that we read were accurate, it's a very fierce song. So, um, and now we will link that in the description. Please look for that in the description. Um, and let us know, by the way, if, it, if, it's, if it's accurate. But either way, even if those are not accurate, you could feel the fierceness in that song. It was just, wow. She's one of those artists we're gonna be adding to our playlist because she's a very strong singer. Very it leaves you, it leaves you feeling- that confident, strong, it leaves you like feeling, I say, husky type. It leaves you feeling voice. the way you would feel after watching a a like long triumphant historical drama. Yeah, uh -huh. hey, like yeah. Gladiator. I can see that. Yeah. Remember, that was one of my favorite historical yeah. dramas and like or movies. And the way you felt that last mm, scene roll, the last scene, yeah, that feeling that's the you get. That's, that's the kind of feeling I got after her song ended. I was like, wow, whoa, that makes sense. Yeah, that makes sense. Wow. Like that could have been one of those movies right there. It's like, wow, holy cow. And you're right, she has this sort of husky quality in her voice that leaves you, it gives you chills. It leaves you, and that's what I mean. It's like that feeling you get after watching one of those movies, you know? It's it's the same feeling that- you, It gives you a hangover. It does it gives give you a hangover. hangover. It gives it you a music hangover. hangover. You know, this is my first experience with, um, 
with her or this beautiful thing about this channel is we're being introduced to music that we might not would have known about would before. not have been introduced to before but it's the same feeling as like your artist here that you know when you have an artist in you know your own country and stuff like that but you just oh, love you know, everything love. they release yeah. and, you, and you have that it's the same feeling as like when i first when i first heard adele sing like hello and stuff it's that same feeling i get you know when i watch her perform this on this show so that's why you know i compared that um, but she's just she's she's, she's, very, she's got a very powerful vocal so that, that's that's why I say that. So I loved it. It was so fierce. It was just my it was so fierce. That's the word I keep that keeps coming to my head yeah. when I think about that performance. It was so fierce, and I need that on my playlist, my, especially my writing playlist. It was just that was brilliant. Thank you so much for watching with us. Thank you.